Good afternoon, Builder News. I am Breck. This is Builder News. Um, builders helping builders. So if you're building something on the web, anyone can record one of these videos. Just get yourself Loom or a similar open source software or program. Download it and record yourself using someone's product for the first time. Post it to Builder News and share. Um, let's spread optimism. Let's help each other out. Let's take a look at what someone's building on over on the Twitter. We've got a Shadsian dash form. Let's take a look at this. Build your forms faster. Create forms with Shadsian, React hooked form, and Zod within minutes. I don't know what those are. I feel like I've heard of this thing a lot. Um, playground, after successfully installing, you can simply copy and paste. Um, okay. So, oh, checkbox. Preview, JSON, code. So, code, okay. Combo box. Input. This is very snappy. Okay. Now we're getting somewhere. Input. Name. My name is placeholder. Um, I don't know. Required. Let's make it text. Save changes. Cool. And username. Okay. So I get it. It's a nice, got a nice GUI. You got all the things here. Nice style. Now, um, I've got a, I've got uh, some stuff on on web forms, the future of web forms, my friend. Web forms for geniuses. Now it might not look like much, but trust me, this is the future. Um, basically, all web forms can be a single text area, and that is going to become very important um, in the future. Um, so basically, this is your traditional form. And here's how it can look with this. Now you might think, why would I want something like this? Well, first of all, you, you could, we could, I mean, we don't have it yet, but you could, as you fill this out, you could update this. But look at the benefit of this. Look at this, e-receipts, um, I can version control this application. So imagine your form fill is actually 30 steps, you know, like a application for a grant or something. You can remember, imagine it's a tax return. So many things you can do with one text area. That is the future of forms for sure. But of course, this is this is a nice execution of maybe state of the art of, of the current technology. But but tomorrow it's all about forms. It's all about scroll. Um, and um, anyway, that's where the puck is going. So. But this is really cool. I love. I mean, it's simple. You you dropped me in. You delivered value before. I, um, you know, I, you didn't require a sign up. I, I think it's really nicely done. I like the playground. Um, yeah, you should check out Scroll. But I would give Shad to Shadkin. How do you even pronounce that? I have no idea. What is this thing that everyone's talking about? Uh, actually, you, you provided a link to it somewhere. Here we go. Component library. Sha DCN. Am I just being an idiot and not reading that? Shaden. Yeah, nice. So I, I feel like I've seen this component library. People are using it. Looks good. Cool. Nice job, Mr. Who are you, Mr. Harmon? Let's have a like, have a follow, um, and um, this is nice. So yeah, if you need if you need state of the art forms right now, something that people are familiar with, this seems like a great choice. Um, and yeah, and sir, Mr. Mr. Harmon, I would uh, take a look at scroll. It, it, it's going to pay the people that master scroll now early. Oh my goodness, are they going to make a lot of money? <laughs> uh, I should know I made a lot of money when when JSON first came out. Um, 
and this is going to be the next wave, my friend. All right, great job. Um, two thumbs up for Shad CN. Oh, I gotta. I liked this one too. This is uh, Geronimo. All right. Cheers.